Lev 1. Read the statement and answer the questions. The cerebral cortex of the human brain is modified into a complex neocortex. A. Write any two advanced mental processes enabled by the brain development. Answer. Thinking, decision making, learning and recalling. Write any two. B. Imagine a person stops learning new things. How would this affect their neocortex over time? Justify your answer. Answer. When new learning or experiences stop, the formation of new synapses in the neocortex decreases. Over time, this reduces the efficiency and effectiveness of the brain, leading to a decline in the memory, reasoning and overall cognitive abilities. 12. Observe the illustration and answer the questions A. Identify P and write how is it formed. Answer P. Chiasma. In the first phase of meiosis, pairing of homologous chromosomes, the chromatids break at chiasma region. B. How does the subsequent process lead to variation? Answer The broken segments are exchanged with each other. Crossing over causes a recombination of alleles. This leads to the appearance of new traits in the offspring. 13a. Redraw the diagram, label the parts correctly if there is any mistake and write their functions. Answer. Correct thalamus labeling or the name. 1. Plays an important role in problem solving, planning and voluntary movements. Act as center of memory, intelligence, thinking and imagination. Provides various sensory experiences. 2. Act as the relay station of messages to and from the cerebrum, painkillers act on this part of the brain or coordinates muscle activities and maintains body balance. 3. Initial assessment of messages regarding vision and hearing. This part has a role in the movement of eyes and eyebrows. B. Observe the illustrations and answer the questions. A. Draw illustration Y including the distribution of charges. Answer. B. How does this change help in the transmission of impulses? Answer. When stimulated, positive ions from outside the cell membrane enter the cell, the outer surface becomes negatively charged and the inner surface becomes positively charged. This charge change is temporary. When the area returns to its original state, charge change occurs in the adjacent area and similar change occur there too. As this process proceeds, impulses get transmitted through neuron. 14. Analyze the situation and answer the questions. A. Identify the specific patterns of inheritance demonstrated in the plant and the cattle respectively. Answer. Plant incomplete dominance and cattle co-dominance. B. Differentiate between these two patterns of inheritance. Answer. Incomplete dominance. A dominant allele cannot fully hide the allele of the recessive trait. Co-dominance, both alleles exhibit their traits at the same time. 15. Observe the illustration showing the evolution of long-necked giraffes according to Lamarck and answer the questions. Explain this on the basis of Darwin's theory of natural selection. Answer. According to Darwin, environment selects the favorable variation in organisms. Giraffe with necks of varying length. There was a scarcity of food on the ground. Giraffes with longer neck could reach leaves on tall trees and thus survived better. Only the giraffes with longer necks survived in the competition for food. The favorable variation was passed on to the next generations. Over many generations, only giraffes with long neck survived, leading to the evolution of the present-day species. 16a. Analyze the statement and answer the questions. Human beings have 23 pair of chromosomes, of which one set is inherited from mother and the other from the father. a. How can you classify these chromosomes based on the functions? Answer. Somatic chromosomes, 22 pairs, control physical characteristics of the body, Sex chromosome 1 pair involved in sex determination X and Y chromosomes. B. Is the 23rd pair of chromosomes same in all individuals? Explain. 
Answer: No, the 23rd pair is not the same in all individuals. In females, the 23rd pair consists of two X chromosomes. XX in males, the 23rd pair consists of one X chromosome and one Y chromosome XY. Or B. Observe the illustration related to protein synthesis and answer the questions. A. Identify the stages indicated as X and Y. Answer X transcription and Y translation. B. RNAs are essential for this process. Explain based on their functions. Answer RNAs are essential for protein synthesis because each type of RNA plays a specific role in the protein synthesis. mRNA messenger RNA. mRNA contains messages for protein synthesis. It carries information about protein synthesis to ribosome. tRNA transfer RNA carry specific amino acids to the ribosome based on message in the mRNA. RNA ribosomal RNA the primary component of the ribosome. It helps in the formation of bonds between amino acids. Thus, without the coordinated functions of mRNA, tRNA and rRNA, protein synthesis cannot take place. 17. Observe illustrations of evolutionary tree and answer the questions. A. Which domain shares a common ancestor with eukarya? Answer. Archae. B. Which are the recently evolved kingdom in eukarya? Answer. Plantae, fungi and animalia. C. How are the kingdoms mentioned in the illustration related to LUCA? Answer. LUCA, last universal common ancestor, refers to the single shared ancestor of all known life on earth. From LUCA, three main lineages arose – Bacteria, Archae and Eukarya. Archae and Eukarya share a common ancestor that bacteria do not. Archae and Eukarya share a more recent common ancestor, while bacteria diverge earlier. Within Eukarya, Protista originated first and later Plantae, Fungi and Animalia evolved from it. 18a. Observe the illustration of monohybrid crows and answer the questions. a. What are the alleles that control seed shape? Answer. Capital R and small r. b. Write the phenotype and genotype of F1. Answer. Phenotype, round seed. Genotype, capital R, small r. F1 cross with wrinkled seed. C. Illustrate the hybridization of the F1 generation with the wrinkled seed plant. Answer. The diagram is given. Ratio 1 is to 1, round is to wrinkled. B. Observe the illustration of dihybrid crows considering height of the plant and shape of the seed and answer the questions. A. Fill in 1 and 2. Answer. 1. Capital T, small r. 2. Capital T, small t, capital R, small r. B. Are there any new traits appearing in the second generations that were not seen in the parents? Why? Answer. Yes. Toll and wrinkled seeds. Capital T, capital T, small r, small r. Capital T, small t, small r, small r. Dwarf and round seeds, small t, small t, capital R, capital R. Small t, small t, capital R, small r appear. When two or more different traits are combined, each trait is inherited independently to the next generation without mixing each other. Mendel's law of independent assortment. C. Why are plants with traits like dwarfness and wrinkle seed less frequent in the F2 generation compared to others? Answer. The traits dwarfness and wrinkle seeds are recessive. For these traits to be expressed, the offspring must receive both recessive alleles small t small t for dwarfness and small r small r for wrinkled. Since this combination occurs less often in gamete fusion, the frequency of plants with dwarf and wrinkled seeds small t small t small r small r is low in the F2 generation, resulting in a 1 out of 16 ratios.